Thank you, Mr. Speaker, members. You know, this is a replay of 2011, you know, with continued uh, discriminatory legislation that the majority in this body has passed. But if you look at the outcomes, we're here again because of that. Voter ID failed, redistricting failed, SB4 will soon fail, and regardless of the session, this body continues to build yet another barrier and obstacle for minorities. This voter ID, or should I say this voter restriction, voter suppression bill will continue to oppress Texans' right to vote regardless of the changes that are made to it. The House will come to order. A bill written and fortified on pure speculation. Many of you have never had the experience of being treated differently because of your race. Or as Mrs. Thompson mentioned the other night, many of you have never walked in our shoes. I can still remember growing up and hearing my parents and grandparents talking about not being able to go to the south side of, of our town after 9 p.m. or eat at a local restaurant because you have to pick up your order at the back door, all because of our race and the color of our skin. This bill is yet a continued attack on minorities and undermines their right to vote. And members, after my incident on New Year's Eve, I was told countless times that there was a purpose for me. And although I feel members in this body have gone too far at times, I know that that purpose I'm here for is to represent the less fortunate, the vulnerable, the children, the uninsured, the women of this state, the man who carries a lunch pail to work, the student who's bullied, the teacher, the parent, the Texan. And I will continue to defend them and all who are treated differently because I won't allow continued discrimination in the state because everyone is created in God's image and he loves us all, not only those who the majority in this body chooses. And regardless of how this bill is crafted, we sure encourage and make it easier for Texans to vote. Being that this bill doesn't do that, Mr. Speaker, show me voting no against continued voter suppression and discrimination in the state of Texas.